Corvo, oh, my friend. <coughs> you need ammunition or weaponry? I don't think I have Would you much. Like me to craft something for you? Let's have a look. I don't think much has happened since I did my last quest. But you know what? Let's stock up. I wish you sold healing potions. That would be great. Nothing here. I can. It's useful to me. All right. That's all we're doing. Fully stocked up on those, at least. Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard. Cruel beyond words. Well, you're an alcoholic, Further, I think. My brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent. But, you know. And as long as they are in whatever. Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Drinking and shooting. Let's just say that not you're every family, family evicted so. and quarantined for a having a play. Um, I'm Actually, thinking you're a little bit sketchy. A little friendly. skeptical of you, but... I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the City Watch. So it'll be dangerous. Now go. Of course it will. Please do it before I change my mind. to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. Yeah, let's go. I need to get better at shooting. Loyalists believe that Emily is being held at the Golden Cat by the corrupt arist aristocratic Pendleton brothers. These men are Lord Pendleton's despised older brothers, twins, and they are loyal to the tyrannical Lord Regent. Find Emily at the Golden Cat and eliminate Lords Curtis and Morgan Pendleton. Cool. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. Ooh. They sell the elixir that folks use I've to fight off the plague. I've that. I'll lay low, Probably but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. Okay. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Well, Be no careful idea. going up the street, court. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. Okay. Mission clues. Resulting more rats and weepers, different reactions from your allies, and darker final outcomes. Well, I'm not trying to kill people, but my stealth is horrible.
wonder if anyone would notice it. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Anyone with information pertaining to the death of High Overseer Thaddeus Campbell is to report to the City Watch for immediate questioning. In this time of spiritual crisis, the Overseers have initiated the Feast of Peace in Campbell. Until a new High Overseer... Hey! You're just the man I was looking for. Slackjaw's wanting to talk no, to you. Of course she is. Nobody here wants to kill me yet. I suppose that's good. Is that him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, we got a message for you from Slackjaw. He wants to talk at the distillery. Okay. I don't think they're gonna last much longer. That's what they get for taking free swigs from the still. That tainted elixir is bad stuff, I guess. Need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slackjaw keeps the good stuff for himself. The rest of us get one part elixir, three parts of water. He is a villain if I judge your looks aright. A villain I might have some work for. Somebody put plague in the brew tank. Half my men are weepers. Trapped three of them in the distillery. Rest are wandering in the street. Since it's so, and I find myself short of able bodies. Oh, I just made myself I may a have job. A point That's of excellent. For you, see? Way I figure it, there ain't nobody worth killing round here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See, slack your nose. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while, not sure why. There's a lot of security at the Golden Cat tonight, though. Special guests in the night. But you're gonna walk in there, dressed like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe I got a better way to take care of them, too. If you're doing something for me first, understand? Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Sure. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Okay. Anything to 
smoke or eat? Huh. 